People who are born with a male body, um, but actually inside they feel female. I, told, I said, describe when they look in the mirror and they see the angular jaw and they see the Adam's apple and that facial hair and their body hair. And then actually when they see that thing up down there uh, sticking out, it just feels so wrong. Um, and they want rid of it. it, you know, they hate it. Um, people uh, try and cut it off themselves. People have used, you know, like the ring that we use on lamb's tails to let the lambs, you know, they use that to, to cut it off. They absolutely hate, hate you know, in the, in the extremes, hate their male, male body. Um, and for, when, for the trans men um, who are born genetically female, you know, when their breasts start developing, you know, they, they just, it just doesn't feel right. You know, it, men don't like having boobs. Um, and so they bind, um, and they start binding to, 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 to flatten the breast as much as they can. Um, and, then, and then actually they, it feels very flat down there, and they don't like it. That's not what they, it, it, it should feel like. It feels like there should be something more prominent down there. And so surgery is actually a big part for, for these people. It's very unaccessible, and you know, it, it seems to have this idea that it's very dangerous. Um, but gender reassignment surgery is something that these people re would really love to have. Um, luckily for the trans women, you can give the hormones, which makes them have breast development, which is lovely. Um, and then they can have um, breast implants as well, same, the same as genetic females can have. So they can develop lovely, lovely breasts of whatever size feels comfortable for them. And actually, I mean, if you watch the videos of, of transgender surgery, gender reassignment surgery, it's amazing. What, what they can do, because actually our bone structure is designed to either be male or female. So actually, the surgery that you can do um, is, is really very clever. Um, and for men, the, 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 uh, I'll tell you how it works, but the inside of the penis can be taken away, and the skin of the penis can be inverted to make a vagina. Um, the scrotum, uh, the testicles are taken away, and the scrotum is used to fashion um, some lips some labia, because that's what would have happened in the womb. Um, we were, we're all born to start off with a, a conception exactly the same, and then it's the hormones from our, our genes, our XY chromosomes, that make it change either into a girl or a boy. So actually we've all got everything right that can be girl or boy, and the surgery is, is really extremely clever. Um, for, me, for, for female to male surgery, um, you, they use the labia majora um, and put testicular, testicular implants in um, and, and fuse the, 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 the lips together to make a scrotum and put implant, um, uh, testicular implants in. And they use the clitoris and the, which grows with testosterone um, and fashion a penis out of it. So it, it's, it's really clever stuff, um, which is really fantastic.